I'm going to show you one of my favourite games that I came across from a wonderful organisation called Enrich. It's an easy game to play, but a really difficult game to master. So I'll show you how it's played and then different ways that you can kind of extend and deepen the challenge. So to play NIM7, you just need seven things. It's a two player game and on your go, you take either one or two items and the winner is the person who takes the last one um, or the last ones. Um, so do you want to go first or second? I'll go first and I'll take two. Okay, uh, I'm going to take one. I'll take one as well. And I'll take one. Yay! I'll take two, thank you very much. So once you've played NIM7, have another go, have a few goes. Is it best to go first? Is it best to go second? What's the winning strategy? There, there is one. And so think, should I just go first and take one or, or go second? Or, and then when you've done that, maybe have a go with eight counters. Is, are the rules the same or does it change? Or with nine? Or, or what about if you play the game, but this time you could take one, two, or maybe even three counters on your go. Is it the same strategy or a different strategy? Play the game, change the rules, see if you can really extend your thinking and enjoy.